Hi everyone! Today I would like to talk about the HDR settings of Mortal Kombat 11. Like my other videos about the HDR game settings, this will start traditionally. Step 1. Set the correct RGB range in the TV settings. It may also be called the black level, depending on your TV. If the range is not correct, you will see washed out colors and low contrast. This is a mistake. Step 2. It's good if you know the peak brightness value of your TV. For example, from the specification or from the rtings.com website. Step 3. Finally, let's take a look at the HDR settings of the game. The main question that probably interests everyone is what the hell is this? What do standard, high-end, professional modes mean? Why is it necessary to increase HDR brightness up to 4000 nits if no TV has such brightness? How to do it? Let's try to figure it out. As you might guess, these modes determine the peak brightness. But what are these meanings? Let's try to analyze. But first, I must explain that for some games, two parameters of brightness can be distinguished. The first is the typical brightness of the scenes, that is the brightness of most of the frame. It may be of little value. The second is the brightness of light sources, which can be very high, much more than the brightness of your TV. Look. Typical brightness for all scenes of a frame does not exceed 200 nits, and in all three modes it particularly does not change. Only the brightness of some light sources changes. These are glare, the sun, lights, and so on. After analyzing several scenes, here are the approximate values. It's not accurate, but you can get a rough idea of the levels. Of course, this approach, when the main brightness of the game scenes is low and only some light sources artificially increases the value, is not available in all games. Most games calculate the brightness of the entire frame based on a given peak brightness. This is the meaning of HDR settings in games. Remember the HDR in Final Fantasy XV. But the final question is, which HDR mode should you choose in Mortal Kombat 11? How do you get the correct result on your TV? Here's an answer. It doesn't matter which one you choose. The brightness of light sources in all three modes is likely to be higher than your TV's possible peak brightness. For example, the brightness of your TV is 800 nit. In most areas, the brightness does not exceed 200 nits in all three modes. Only the brightness of the light sources changes. If you turn off the tone mapping modes of your TV, then all brightness above 800 nits will be clipped. A light, glare, sun will lose detail in the bright area but will have the maximum brightness allowed for your TV. Or you can turn on your TV's tone mapping mode, such as DTM. The TV will try to transform the brightness of the entire frame to match the capabilities of your TV. Choose the option that you like the best result. Both spots are not ideal. As for settings the gamma parameter, just like in other games where there is a middle point parameter, you should stick to a balanced neutral value. You can adjust a little, but if the image has washed out colors and low contrast, then most likely problems with the RGB range. See step 1. Thanks to all. Hope the video was helpful. Like and subscribe to the channel. Bye.